Okay guys, what we're going to do here on this video, I am going to remove the side of this uh, uh, Asus G20CB. Uh, this particular one is uh, Asus G20CB. It's 32 mega RAM, 512 south state drive, and uh, 3.4 gigahertz processor, and has the NVIDIA Foundation 1070 uh, video card. Now, I also have a one terabyte solid state drive. Uh, to the right of this picture, that is what I'm doing. Uh, you can see the side, I'm taking that side off, and I'm going to run it right now on the middle here where you see the GPU temperatures. The minimum is 52. The maximum is 84. Now I have the side on it right now and I'm going to take it off and it's been running for about seven minutes. So you're going to hear a little noise and while I do that, I'll be, I'll be taking it off. Okay. So let me move this a little. Last time I hit the power button and turn the computer off. We don't want to do that this time. Okay. So I'm taking it off. Okay guys. Uh, I, now I started this uh, with the side off. I restarted the software and everything. It looks like we're at a minimum of 70, a maximum of 78. Okay. Um, I guess uh, it looks like it's a little bit better. 78, uh, 79, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, about 6 degrees difference on the maximum. The minimum was still at 70, but uh, I don't know. But uh, so it looks like it's pretty leveled off. So. Taking the side off to save you stuff, is 6 degrees enough to save you? Um, let's go on to 79 now, so let's see. We'll give it a little time to climb. Like I say, before it was in the 80s. Okay, so it's still inching up a little. We'll let it run a little longer here, a few more minutes. Choppy, so it's right at about 79 up in there. So, uh, airflow does help. Now, the question is on this case here if I make a hole here and here and one down there, uh, will it help it? You know, I could make a hole here with a hole saw here, here, and then put a screen in there and little lights behind it. It would actually look cooler with a few lights on it. So, I'll probably do it anyway. But uh, if I can save a few degrees, that's cool. Because I think it was at 84 before. Doesn't look like it's going to change from uh, 79. So 80, about 5 degrees difference. Which, yeah, it helps. You know, any, anything helps. You know, especially in a computer if you can keep that processor down. But this is, I mean real heavy stress test software. So there you have it guys, uh, real world test.